here's everything you need to know about the UAE's new 9% corporate income tax rate. On December 9th of 2022, the United Arab Emirates Ministry of Finance released a new law introducing corporate tax to the United Arab Emirates for the very first time. And this tax rate has already been implemented starting on June 1st of 2023. However, any personal income, real estate profits, investments, capital gains profits still have 0% tax. Now the 9% corporate tax is only subject to companies with business profits that exceed 375,000 dirhams or 102,000 US dollars, which means that if your company does less than 375,000 dirhams in business profits, then you're exempt from paying any corporate taxes. And the 9% corporate tax is still one of the lowest in the world with 180 other countries averaging a corporate tax of 23%, and Europe averaging a corporate tax of 21%. Now this tax was introduced to meet global standards with an international effort to combat tax avoidance. But the UAE has stated that with the help of this corporate tax, they'll continue to promote an attractive business environment, helping startups, small businesses, and the overall economy. But the real question is, what does this 9% corporate tax mean for free zone companies? Provisions have been released showing how they will tax specific free zone companies. Free zone companies producing qualifying income will be exempt from the 9% tax and will be taxed at 0%. But a 9% tax rate will be applied on taxable income that is not qualifying income. Some of the qualifying activities listed in Article 2 of the Ministerial Decision include manufacturing and processing goods or materials, holding of shares and other securities, ownership management and operation of ships, regulated reinsurance and fund and wealth management, financing and leasing of aircraft, and the distribution of goods in or from a designated zone and logistics services. So at the moment, if your company doesn't fit in that list and your business profits exceed 375,000 dirhams, then the 9% corporate tax would be applied to you. But for more detailed information on the activities and the specific tax, book a call below and one of our accountants at GenZone will be glad to tell you more. Now, although the corporate tax has already been introduced starting on June 1st of 2023, there has also been a small business tax relief that has also been introduced at the same time. This allows eligible businesses to treat their taxable income as zero for a specific period of time, essentially meaning that small businesses will not have to pay any corporate tax for the qualifying amount of time. So how do you qualify? Businesses and individuals that generate annual revenues up to 3 million dirhams are eligible to receive this benefit. Now, what is the timeline of this relief? This relief is available for the financial years between June 1st, 2023 up till December 31st of 2026. But if the business's revenues exceed 3 million dirhams in a prior tax period, then they won't be eligible for this relief. To put this in perspective, let me give you an example. Imagine you own a clothing store that has an annual revenue of 2.5 million dirhams. Because the annual revenue falls below the 3 million dirham threshold, you are eligible for the small business tax relief. Between June 1st, 2023 up till December 31st, 2026. But if business picks up and you exceed 3 million dirhams in annual revenue, say in 2024, then from that point on, you're no longer eligible to receive the small business tax relief. If you want to learn more about the corporate tax rate and what you should do to be prepared, or you want to open a free zone company in the UAE or a company in general, and you want to know how, be sure to book a call with a link in the description and our experts at GenZone will help you do exactly that. We'll see you there.